I'm not counting. We're going to be ready in June, and that will be the most important thing. No, he's just come off the pitch. Let's, let's <laughs> let the injury take its course. He'll go back to his club, they'll assess it, and hopefully it's not too serious. Done. Were you frustrated away by the fact that even though Norbalan took the goal early on in the first half, he had a lot of the game to, to try and get that equaliser? No, we had a lot of the game. We we tried our best to open them up. They were, like I said, it was difficult to find space between the lines. Was it? For us, it was a diff totally different type of game to what we've had recently where you're playing against the the top teams and, and they'll just open the pitch and the pitch was open. You saw that on Friday night when we managed to create a number of really good chances. Tonight, when we needed maybe a little bit of craft and a little bit of gale towards the, the final third of the pitch, we couldn't find that. And that's basically why we lost the game. We had a, more than a lion's share of the possession, uh, 14 shots, but not one good enough to, to go in the back of the net. It's probably fair to say we're not very good at friendlies because we don't win too many of them. So let's hope it's when it comes to the competitive stuff in June that we're ready to go. I'm sure we will be. No, I don't know. don't know. Not, not for me to comment on. It's what it is. Okay. Steve, uh, reflecting on the international break as a whole, what can you, what positives can you take? Because obviously tonight was a very, as much as you didn't win the game again, it's a very different kind of match to what you experienced when you were in Amsterdam, where you had a little bit more space to kind of play into. What positives can you take over the last two games? You can always take positives. Performances on the pitch. I thought Liam Cooper was good at centre back tonight. It was nice to see. Coops hasn't played much for his club this year, so it's nice to see that he's kept himself in shape. It's good to get Nathan back on the pitch, another game for young Nathan. He's not playing enough football at his club, but when he comes here, he's, he gets a chance to play. So Those are probably two positives from tonight. Uh, got Lyndon on the pitch. Good performance for 70 minutes against the top side Thursday night. We, we've spoken about that. It's good. We have to be better at the... The bits that weren't so good, and we'll go away. I'll assess the games, I'll assess both games. And like you said, the, the biggest thing for us is to be ready for June. You know, and I'm a little bit late into the press conference. I'd rather be sitting here in my position than, unfortunately, Wales have just been knocked out on penalty kicks. So it's not all doom and gloomy. Today was a, really, was a different kind of game, do you think, from when you're going to experience when you get to Germany, given the possession of the ball and the kind of. It was it was different. We knew it would be different, and it's been a it's been a while since we played against the, that type of team with a really low block and and good counter attack. I have to say, I thought Northern Ireland had good players getting forward. They scored with their only their own, sorry they had two two chances in the first half. They scored with one of them. So credit to them. It's not it's not the type of game that we'll have in the Euros. I don't think. I don't think the the teams that we're going to play against will play that way. So. It was just a nice little reminder for us that you have to be, you, have, you need quality in the final third of the pitch to score goals. After this camp, how much clearer are you in your head of what your squad's going to look like for the next camp in the tournament? Too many games to play, too many, too many things can happen. So let's let's wait till the start of May, see who's fit and see who's available. Hopefully everybody. I just want more from me, Steve. I think we're talking about positives. Like Lewis Ferguson played well when he came on. As Good. As yeah, it was nice. And and also, he came on and we changed the system as well, which which is good to see us playing with a different system. Uh, he's good in that position. He was also good when I asked him to play off the right. Looked a goal threat. Got in the box a couple of times and makes good runs. So, no, nah, it's well pointed out. Another positive. Sorry, Thank you. One more.